Antibronchial lung volume reduction is the latest FDA-approved therapy for patients with severe emphysema. Emphysema is a chronic lung condition that affects smokers, and it results in destruction of lung tissue and progressive development of shortness of breath. The premise behind endobronchial lung volume reduction is that patients with severe emphysema may have extra air that's trapped in their lung. This air trapping can result in a weakness of the muscles of breathing, and it also puts pressure on the diaphragm and the chest wall, thereby resulting in shortness of breath. Valves are small devices that have a mechanism to open and close so that when the patient takes a breath in, the valve will close, and when a patient exhales, the valve will open and allow air to egress from the area of the lung where the valves are placed, thereby over time causing volume reduction. My name is Linda DeBarry, and I'm Dr. Shostak's patient. I really very much wanted to be able to talk about the benefits of having the lung valves because it's changed my life tremendously. I've come from severe COPD, stage four. I wasn't able to drive anymore. I wasn't able to take a shower by myself. Getting dressed in the morning was very difficult. People that can breathe normally, they don't realize that when you're short of breath, that everything you do takes so much energy. What I liked about Dr. Shostak was that he wasn't overwhelming. And he said to me, until we know if you are a good candidate, I'm not going to overwhelm you with information. And for me, that was one of the biggest things that I was happy about, was that I needed to go slowly. After a successful procedure, patients may experience relief in dyspnea. They may experience an increase in their energy level. And some of our patients have actually gotten off oxygen. After the procedure, my quality of life has completely changed. Now I'm driving. I can go into the park and walk in the park. I can socialize with my friends. I can sit at dinner without oxygen. I feel like a whole person again. I'm a lot happier and I'm enjoying my life. Because endobronchial lung volume reduction is a bronchoscopic procedure that is done through a small camera with no incisions and no surgery, our protocol here at Weill Cornell is to keep patients in the hospital for several days for observation. After their treatment, patients get frequent chest x-rays to make sure that the lung volume reduction is occurring and they typically go home on day four of their procedure.